Heavenly Father, we come in your presence. We want to thank you once again, Jesus, for all that you have done for us. For all your goodness, for all of your mercy, and I pray to your God just now that as we uh, listen, Lord, to uh, those words say in Psalm 1, Father, I pray that you would be with us. Father, that you would help us from day to day to be the Christians that we ought to be, to be that witness that we ought to be, Lord, in our different communities. And Father, we have the joy of your salvation in our heart. And I pray that from day to day, that people will realize and know that we belong to you. Father, none of us Christians are perfect, but we thank you, Jesus, today, that when we asked you for forgiveness, that you came in and you forgave us of our sin. And we thank you, Lord, for the peace, for the joy, for that contentment that only can come from you. And Father, I pray just now that if there's one person gathered in here today, that they need salvation, I would ask, Lord, that just now that they would reach out to you and that they too would be blessed knowing, Lord, that they're on their way to heaven and home. And Father, if there's one who do not know you, I pray just now, Lord, that they would hold on to your nail scarred hands. Father, bless us. And we thank you again that we could come in your sanctuary, that we could worship you with the very beauty of holiness. And Father, we thank you that your grace is still flowing. Father, it's the same as was yesterday, today and forever. And we thank God that it never changes. But today will come, dear God, we know that someday we will have to stand before you and to give an account of how we spent our life here on uh, this world. I would ask, Lord, that you would be with us, direct us, and bless us. In the precious name of Jesus, amen.